Hi y'all, it's Beth here and um, today I am pre-recording, it's September 1st and I am recording my um, wax project use it up um, for the summer like finale and also I just want to apologize if you guys can hear loud purring in the background milkshake is sitting like right behind me you can probably see his like the top of his head right there that's him right there um he is purring so loudly he has just kind of decided that he's allowed now to just show up in my bedroom whenever he wants um so yeah, I mean, I'm not going to do anything about it because, like, he's 16 by now and he's, like, an old cat. So, if he decides that he wants to be in my bedroom, on my bed, then, you know, he's lived his life. He is an old guy now, so I don't think I'm going to change that habit from him. Um, Literally, last night, I just walked upstairs and right away, he just already was, like laying in like the center of my bed like I could not fit on there and I was like milkshake like you gotta go to the corner or something because I need to have room to sleep here like this is my bed but anyways today we're here to talk about the finale for my wax project use it up for summer of 2021 I've gotten through a lot of melts this summer I'm actually going to count how many 18 melts in the month of August and hold on a second because I left some stuff over there okay I'm back so I got through five melts in the month of June 16 melts in the month of July and now 18 melts in the month of August so that is pretty exciting. First, we can start with like a recap of June and July. So in June, I got through Biscuits and Jam, Kick from Rainbow Melts, Champagne Toast Mango Sorbet Georgia Peach from L3. There's that one. I got through Pineapple Fizzy Pop from Zape. And Seaside Laundry from the Melted Mousse. And then in July, I got through Strawberry Soda and Blue Raspberry Slushy from Rose Girls. Cranberry Citrus from Ava's. Sweet Cheeks from Rainbow Melts. Coffee Bean Sea Salt Caramel from L3. Drop of Sunshine from Zape. Um, blueberry Cobbler from the Melted Mousse. Blue Grotto from Scentsy. Lemon Mallow Cookie Bread from Rainbow Melts. Always Kiss Me Goodnight from the Melted Mousse. Cinnamon Broom from Ava's. Cookie Dough Noel from Ava's. Snickerdoodle Zucchini from Ava's, um, Cotton Candy Craze from Ava's, Peppermint Fluff from Ava's, Eggnog Cookie Dough Donuts from Ava's, and Birch Please from Super Tarts. Okay, and since I went through 18 wax melts in August, that puts me at a total of 39 wax melts for the summer emptied. My goal was 45, so I think I came pretty close to my goal, which is pretty exciting. So let's talk about what did I go through in August, and then I will share with you guys kind of like what I would hope to have in my melting basket for next summer. So from Ava's, I have Celestial Sea. I have Rose Girls Tea and Cakes. I really enjoyed both of these, by the way. Um, from L3, Lemon Mint Leaf Fizzy Soda. I also enjoyed that one. Um, also from L3, Espresso Sugar Cookie Royale. That one was a hit. And Coffee Bean Sea Salt Caramel, that one was a hit also. 
and Teddy B's Frankish Princess. The notes are patisserie and blackberry butter pecan cookies. So those were my bags I went through. My samples I went through were Teddy B's London Peony and Blush Suede, the Melton Moose Fairy Garden, Ava's Country Cupboard European Cafe, Milkshake is purring so loud, I don't know if you guys can hear. Ava's Country Covered Teeny Streets. Okay, and then we can talk about some scent shot cups. So I have that Smell Good Shop Ultimate Lemon. Um, smoothie Sailing from that Smell Good Shop. That Smell Good Shop Lemon Head and that Smell Good Shop Sugared Lemon. From Yankee Candle, I have Meadow Showers. From The Melted Moose, I have Black Raspberry and Vanilla and What the Carb. And then I have two clamshells. This one is in Sensi's Apple Butter Frosting. And this one is in Up North Creations Pina Colada. And so, yeah, that is what I got through this summer. Um, I'll be back in just a second with my ideal summer wax stash and then we will talk about what do I have left over that I am planning on storing until next spring summer. What do I have left over that I'm planning on carrying over into the fall. So I will be back in a jiffy. You won't even know I've been gone. Okay, so first off, I wanted to share like two honorable mentions of scents that I definitely would repurchase again, but I wouldn't include them in my spring summer melting basket, but it's ones that I definitely would include in fall and winter. This one is Ava's Country Cupboard Cookie Dough Noel and Ava's Country Cupboard Snickerdoodle Zucchini. So I would love to have these for the winter time, but um, you know, not for the spring summer because I just have so many spring summer scents that I found that I like that, you know, I don't wanna have them taking up a spot in that list. And then without any further ado, we can go ahead and get into my ideal spring and summer wax melting basket if I only could base it off of the scents that I melted that were part of this project. So if that were the case, these are the scents that I would pick. I have a bunch of bags, a couple of clams, a couple of scent shot cups to talk about. So um, I have Rainbow Melts Lemon Mallow Cookie Bread. This one was so amazing. Um, a really good gourmand lemon scent. I have that Smell Good Shop Biscuits and Jam. This one is so nice. I really, really enjoyed it. And I would have it again in the spring and summertime. Um, also, Rainbow Melt Sweet Cheeks. This one is Cookie Heaven and Boom Boom. I loved this scent. And I would repurchase it to have for next spring and summer. The Melted Moose Always Kiss Me Goodnight. I really liked that one. And it would be so cute for a Valentine's Day melting basket in February. So I definitely would repurchase um, for my melting basket for next spring and summer. Ava's Country Cupboard Cranberry Citrus. This one is nice to have for Christmas in July. And um, Ava's Country Cupboard Celestial Sea. This one I would love to take with me on beach vacations. So um, that one was nice. Teddy B's Frankish Princess, which is warm donuts, baked bread, powdered sugar, and a touch of spice blended with butter pecan waffles, blackberry jam, and butter cookies. This one is so good. I could use it literally any season. It's just a very nice bakery scent. From L3 Waxy Wonders, I would repurchase coffee bean sea salt caramel to include next spring summer. Espresso sugar cookie royale from L3 for next summer and also lemon mint leaf fizzy soda from L3 for next summer and I also would include Rose Girls tea and cakes in my melting basket for next spring summer as well 
So all of those were very nice. Okay, so there's a total of 22 things from this year out of 39 that I would get again for next year. So I feel like that's pretty good. Um, Sensi's Blue Grotto is definitely one I would get again. And Sensi's Apple Butter Frosting is definitely one that I would get again. Zape's Pineapple Fizzy Pop. The notes are Fresh Cut Pineapple and Bubbly Citrus Fizz. This one I definitely would get again for next year. Up North Creations Pina Colada. I definitely would get this one for next year. It smells so good. I have the Melted Mousse What the Carb. The notes are cake, donuts, bread. If it's a carb, it's in here. And Seaside Laundry. The notes are clean cotton and sea mist. And the Melted Mousse Blueberry Cobbler, which also smells amazing. And I would include all of these in my melting basket for next spring, summer. Smoothie Sailing. The notes are zucchini, vanilla, blackberry, and raspberry. This would be good in the summer, but also in the fall. And Lemon Head, which is tart and sweet lemon candies. This one was so nice. And then from a Yankee Candle, I have the Centerpiece Cup in Meadow Showers. Okay, now for the things that I have left. So I have a lot left. We'll start with the stuff that I'm going to be like tucking away until next year, like around February or so when I start on spring and summer scents again. I have the Melton Moose Fizzy Pop and the Melton Moose Berry Waffle Cone. I have Rainbow Melts Beached, and the notes on this are Fizzy Pop, Saltwater Mermaid, and Beach Type. I have L3 Waxy Wonders Stan the Man, which says um, a top secret blend of sweet fruits and amazing creamy coconuts. I also have L3 Yellow Ranger, which is Lemonade, Cherry Limeade, and Fizzy Soda. L3 Paradise Tropical Soda and L3's Root Beer. Teddy Bee's Down in Kokomo and it's 5 o'clock somewhere. I think I'm going to stop reading the scent notes because I just don't have enough time. L3 Waxy Wonders Main Street. Teddy Bee's Dirty Blonde. L3 Waxy Wonder Strawberry Raspberry Guava Cotton Candy. L3 Waxy Wonder Cream Soda. I actually am gonna use this one around Christmas time to mix with Reindeer Nose. Um, Sonoma's Passion Fruit Punch. Up North Creation Fizzy Pop. Super Tarts Borg, Super Tarts Falcon, and Super Tarts Who's A. Up North Creations Blue Hawaiian, Southbound Candle Co. Seaside Treats. Rose Girls Orange Sherbet and Yankee Candles Poolside Oasis. And then two scoopable wax um, from L3. This one is in Blackberry Fizzy Pop and this one is in Zero to Hero. So those are the things I didn't get to that I'm not carrying over into fall, but that I'm just sticking back in my stash until next year. And then I have ones that I didn't use up, but that I'm carrying over into fall. So I have these two samples from L3 in Cookie Therapy. I have L3's Spiral Hill. 
Super Tarts Colvin. Super Tarts Tate. L3 Waxy Wonders Southern Sweet Tea Lemon Curd. Super Tarts Governor. Super Tarts Happy Birthday Harry. L3 Waxy Wonders Ginny. Rainbow Melts Strawberry Frosted Animal Cookies. Teddy Bee's Sweet Peach Iced Tea. Ava's Caramel Cinnamon Latte. Rainbow Melts Magic Donuts. L3 Waxy Wonders Red Ranger. Up North Creations Coffee Bean. L3 Waxy Wonders White Elephant Exchange Tea and Cakes. Um, the Melton Moose Apple Mango Tango. The Melton Moose Lemon Poppy Seed Muffins. The Melton Moose Clean Air. The Melton Moose Raspberry Zingers. The Melton Moose Strawberry Pound Cake. Rose Girls Macintosh Madness. A bag of three samples from Up North Creations. My bag of scent shot cups from That Smell Good Shop. Um, I am gonna carry over Waffle Cone and Serendipity. I know they're not really fall appropriate, but I bought like four backups of this scent, so I really need to get through it. Super Tarts Molo Dramatic. That Smell Good Shop Fresh Coffee. Ava's Country Cupboard Linen Breeze. The Melted Moose Sweet on Paris. And L3's Jelly Glazed Donuts Blueberry Muffin. So yeah, that's everything for my finale for my wax project. Use it up for the summer of 2021. Um, I already have been posting videos about my fall project. So definitely go check it out. Did I use up everything that I was set out to use up? No, but that's okay. I think I still did a pretty good job. I did a better job than if I hadn't have tried at all. So Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. And as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.